Mshako is set to appeal the High Court judgment setting aside the appointment of Hawke's head, Burning Glemeza. On Friday, the court ruled that Glemeza's appointment was irrational. It upheld an application by Freedom and the Law and the Helen Sisman Foundation that the police minister ignored a previous court ruling that Glemeza was unfit to hold office. The embattled Hawke's head has since sought church support. You are unbreakable. You are unmovable. You are untouchable. This Thank time, you, it wasn't a high-profile bust, but as well choreographed. After a lengthy service, Nkemeza was invited to address congregants, the media again in tow. Some people have been speculating about our visit here today. They have utilized the figment of their imagination and told lies which they themselves believe about us. But we are unshaken. And an indication that he's not planning on going anywhere anytime soon. Ama Hawks will go on to do their work to deal with the mandate given to them. But despite insisting that he only attended as a preacher himself, we are praying for general. a prayer service was held for Nkemeza. We are for all the issues of the courts that he's attending, the appeals is going through. God cover him. Police Minister Natin Tego appointed Lemeza as the Directorate for Priority Crime Investigation in September 2015. This despite an earlier court ruling that he lacked integrity and honor and that he made false statements under oath. The police minister says he intends filing appeal papers with the High Court on Monday. He says Lemeza will stay put in his position pending the finalization of the legal process. Angobam Kudu, SABC News, Johannesburg.